Welcome to the next week of Raider Wrap Up. This week on the show, we're going to have a special interview with Coach Youngman, but first, we're going to send it straight over to Reed Hightower to talk to us a little bit about the Beta Club. Hi, I'm Reed Hightower, and I'm here to talk to you a little bit about the Beta Club. First of all, Beta Club is a club of academic excellence. To be in Beta Club, you must maintain a 92 average in your four core classes. And we're about to get a new batch of Beta Club members. Our induction ceremony is February 22nd at 9 a.m. in the upper gym. A little bit about what Beta Club does. Um, It's a club, like I said, of academic excellence, but we also do a little community service. Um, One example is that we potted some plants around the school to help make this beautiful campus even more beautiful. Um, That's really about it, Dustin Bonner. Thank you for having me. It was a pleasure. Thanks for joining us, Reed Hightower. And now we're going to send it over to Brooks Davis with the sports. Hey, guys, this is Brooks Davis with Raider Sports. And not much is going on this week as all of your Raider Spring sports teams are beginning their final practices before their first games and tournaments. The tennis team has already begun play as they lost to Jacksonville last week. The next match will be against Oxford at JSU on Tuesday, February 28th. The varsity softball team will be next to begin their season as they will play in a tournament at Chocolock Park beginning on Friday, February 24th and running until that next day. Next is your Raider baseball team as they will play their first game of the season at home against Ohatchee on Monday, February 27th. Finally, the Raider golf team will not have their first tournament until Saturday, March 11th at Twin Bridges Golf Club. Be sure to come out and support all your Raider sports teams this spring as they begin their 2017 season. That's all for sports this week. Back to you, Dustin. Thanks, Brooks. And now it's time for the interview with Coach Youngman. Dustin Bonner here alongside Coach Youngman, Pleasant Valley's new baseball head coach. Coach, we'd love to hear about how you feel about area competition. Well, we're in a three-team area uh, with uh, Piedmont, Glencoe, and ourselves. Uh, we feel like we've got a really good shot. Uh, Piedmont's traditionally strong, uh, but we feel like um, our seniors have laid a good foundation and we'll be able to compete and uh, win there and uh, the boys competed real hard against Glencoe last year and uh, from looking at uh, stats over the summer um, and what they have coming back I feel like uh, we have a real good chance to win our area this year. Okay so we'd also like to know where do you think the team is the weakest? I think right now um, just the way the seasons run together with basketball and baseball uh, I think right now getting everybody on the same page. Uh, The group that we had that did not play basketball has come out and worked really hard, uh, but it's kind of finding uh, where these basketball guys are coming in and fitting in. Uh, and we need to get um, our coaches situated. Coach Carl was coming out uh, and helping us this year, but he's been caught up in basketball as well. So I think once we get all our coaches on staff and we get everybody into a position, uh, we'll be able to build and uh, strengthen those weak areas. Okay, Coach, and final question. What are your expectations as far as how the season will go? Well, I think uh, we have a really good shot of doing some really special things. Uh, When Mr. Proper asked me to come on, he asked what my expectations were, and those expectations have not changed. Um, We have a great senior group. I've got uh, seven seniors, uh, which is a lot. Uh, Our pitching staff is strong, and we got a couple young guys that's coming up from the junior high uh, that's really going to make an impact on our team, and I feel like... uh, our baseball program is going the right direction. I feel like uh, we can make a deep run in the playoffs. And with the right mindset, hopefully we get to go all the way uh, to the state championship. Okay, Coach. Thanks for joining us today. It was a pleasure having you on. Thank you very much. Thank you. It was a good talk with Coach Youngman, but that will be all for this week. We hope you enjoyed this week of Raider Wrap-Up.